Once upon a time, there was a fox named Riff. Riff traveled far from his home so he could compete in a puzzle contest. Through misadventure, Riff is accused of stealing the Orb of Storms, a human relic that the Morph used to predict the weather. He is able to convince the authorities to give him a chance to find the real thief and recover the orb. Two warriors are assigned to assist and guard Rift in this quest, Ia of the Elf Tribe and Ak of the Boar Tribe. The three journey throughout the land seeking clues, soliciting advice, solving puzzles, and confronting enemies. Eventually, Rift is able to find the true culprit and prove his innocence. But the orb itself is lost, presumed destroyed. And everyone lived happily ever after. So ended the classic video game, Inherit the Earth, Quest for the Orb. Well, not quite the end. There was one more thing. Unit functioning. Dry period is active. Priority request. Set date for ending dry period. Unit awaiting input. Awaiting input. Awaiting input. I think you'll have to agree that is not such a happy ending. I'm Joe Pierce, and I want to tell you about our new project, Inherit the Earth, Sand and Shadows, the point-and-click adventure game sequel to Inherit the Earth, Quest for the Orb. The story continues some time after Rift returned home. There have been unverified rumors that the Orb of Storm survived and has been recovered. Rift discounts these rumors, though he has always been dissatisfied in failing in his attempt to return the Orb. But then the daughter of a tribal chiefess brings word of another claim of an intact Orb but with additional details that only a true discovery could reveal. And so begins a new adventure. Inherit the Earth, Sand and Shadows is an entirely new game designed for modern computer systems and mobile devices. Just like the original game, it will feature gorgeous graphics, a great story, and professional voice acting. Yes, why don't we take a look? As you can see from the concept art for the game, our protagonist will be visiting old haunts, new locations, and encountering myriad inhabitants of the world. The game is being developed by the Wormkeep Entertainment Company and produced by a team of experienced professionals, including excellent artists, writers, programmers, voice actors, and audio techs. Like myself, Many of these individuals were involved in the creation of the original game. We expect that development of Inherit the Earth, Sand and Shadows will take approximately nine months from the point that it is funded via Kickstarter. By becoming a supporter during this funding drive, you can receive some great rewards. These rewards include a copy of the completed game, the soundtrack album, a book of art, prints and posters, your name in the credits, and even your avatar appearing in the game. Join us in making a great sequel to a classic game. We need your help. Become a supporter. Tell your friends to become supporters. Together we can make this happen. Thank you.